Hey, KIC here. Sneaking into, well, I don't know what this is. It's a sign. Sneaking into a sign. I'm guessing it's a gas station just by the looks of it. No, that would be a Born and Noble. So let me show you where I'm at before we get going here. Ended the last episode, said I'd be going northwest. Turns out northwest basically went west and then southwest as it so happened. Hey, look at that. There's a running lumberjack or something. I'm not sure what that is. I do enjoy these foresty biomes here. They're lots of fun. So last episode, I was kind of in that township I just showed you there where I went northwest from. Just poking around there, kind of looking for, I don't know, at this point I'd really like some stuff to upgrade my sniper rifle. That's really the thing I would like the most. I'm not sure how realistic that is to actually find that stuff, I mean. Uh-oh. We got someone chasing... Yeah, I'm trying to let them go because I don't really want to deal with them right now. I mean, sure, I can. It's not a huge, huge imposition, but just the same. Would like to kind of keep things a little quiet since it is still so early in the morning here. I'm going to take a moment and just mention, if you haven't seen it, the last few days I've been posting videos for a game called Ark Survival Evolved. It's basically a survival game, something along the lines of a Seven Days to Die, a Rust, a Daisy, a... Take your pick, really. I mean, there's a lot of survival games out there. They're not exactly a new concept, not by any stretch. The difference with this one is it's kind of like the Stomping Lands in that it has dinosaurs. So, if you like survival games and you like dinosaurs, well, you might want to check it out. It's, um... I don't know, it's still too early for me to, to really come up with what I really think about the game. It's fun, yes. It's definitely fun. Is it great? No, it's not. It's still in early access, so it's a little early to, to really to really say anything about it that's conclusive. But it is fun. Um, one of the biggest problems is it runs incredibly poorly right now. So as I... Hit F8 and bring up the FPS counter on the left that you can now see. That is higher than anything I get in that game. Period. Ever. Oh, hi. Um, let's go ahead and take care of you. I actually meant to get something other than the club, like the shotgun. Because the shotgun will solve my problems. Yes, it will. You know, let's go ahead and stop the bleeding now. Ah, oh, there's no door here. Perfect. I didn't want there to be one anyway. I like there to not be doors when I'm trying to find a moment to stop and heal myself. Keeps it exciting. Anyhow, just uh, like I said, if you're interested, check that out. Basically started a new series after starting a series with it because the devs have been updating it so much, trying to fix things and trying to make it run a little better. And I'll give them credit for that. They're definitely trying to get things in a better condition. I don't know that they're succeeding just yet, but they are trying. Oh, hello. You're going to be a problem, aren't you? Yeah, let's get you out of here. Oh, nothing like being stunned in a corner. Anyone know where I'm at? Nope. Good. Let's keep it that way. Man, there's a lot of zombies in here. I figured there would be because it looked like the door was basically unlocked. Yeah, it's a little dark in here. My apologies for that. You can still more or less see what's going on. I don't have... Oops. My flashlight taped to my head right now, so that's why it's a little darker than usual. Been playing that game the last couple of episodes where... Did that get her? I think that did. Good. Where I'm trying not to lose my mining helmet, so let's go ahead and put the crummy one on. That way I can let everyone see what's going on and not have to deal with the joy of not being able to see anything in here because it is quite dark. Well, for the most part in here it's not so bad, but... And here it is pretty dark. I'm not sure there's any books I'm interested in. I'm fairly certain I have everything at this point, so I'm actually going to ignore all of those and instead check out other things like the file cabinet over here. I'm not collecting, I'm just checking to see here. What am I collecting? I'm not collecting a lot of things. I'm not collecting salmon, for one. Just going to take a moment and stand on the back of this couch here. 
Oh, where are you? I hear you. Maybe I should run back in here where it's nice and open. Yeah, that doesn't seem like a good idea. Here, let me, uh, let me turn that light off for just a moment because I'm going to pop a painkiller. That seems like a good idea right about now. And in fact, just as I'm looking at things, I want to go ahead and get some repairing in order for my... Oh, are you really stone? I forget. You really are stone, aren't you? Yeah, dang it. Wrong tool. It's all right, though. But I thought I'd get some sticks ready so I can repair my crossbow, since it is going to need a little bit of help here. Now, it is 7 o'clock, so zombies will be walking again. That takes the threat down a fair amount. Not really interested in those things. Not really interested in that. We have there, not so much there. Oh, let's see. I'm trying to remember all my keys now. I've been playing both games and going back and forth and getting everything messed up. Gotta love it. Everyone uses a different interface and different standard set of keys just to just to make things interesting. Let's go ahead and use that one stick up. No sense keeping that. I'm going to go ahead and switch back to my football helmet since it is a little on the more protective side. Go ahead and grab those. And then let's go ahead and, well, I guess I can check the boxes. There might be something useful in here. You never know. Look at that right there. I just replaced one of my planks. I'm not collecting brass this go around, am I? I'm sure not. And, well, since the back door is open, let's just go ahead and walk out and see what else is over here. Now, this isn't a township, but there will be some possibility for other buildings to be out here, so I would suspect there should at least be one or two other things. That would be the wrong direction, so I need to go south. South is the correct direction. I would be willing to guess there will be a dump and maybe a garage. Wow, maybe there's nothing. Huh. That's surprising. Ah, there we go. There's a house kind of in the fog. Wow, there are a lot of lumberjacks around. Let's play Whack-a-Lumberjack. Because I would like to go check out that house. Or lodge. Maybe it's a lodge. Lumber mill. Is it a lumber mill? What are you? Huh. It's just like a little cabin there. Well, I would like to check that out in relative peace. Ah, oh, that was a terrible shot. Got her right in the hip. Let's see if I can get her in the face now. There we go. Oh, man, really? So many of you guys. So, so many. Oh, dang it. I was actually doing a pretty good job there of getting rid of them in mostly one bolt. Nothing like killing a stream. Stream? Streak. Streak. There we go. That's the word I want. Come on. We're getting there. Oh, that hit you in the chin. That, that wasn't close enough to your head. The rest of your head. Okay, let's check these guys before they vanish right quick. Try and get through as many of them as I can. I'm... Oh, yeah. <laughs> that reminds me. I was supposed to do something, oh, an episode or two ago. I'll do that. I promise. I'll get around to it. Maybe. Come on. Nothing. Nothing. Oh, look at that. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. And let's just pick up that rock. Stone. Whatever you are. Every game has a different nomenclature as well. Gotta love that. Okay, so this is just a little cabin. A little campfire in there. I like these. Kind of cool place to find early in the game. You know, you need somewhere to just kind of hang for a little bit. Don't feel like... I don't know, making a campfire in the middle of nowhere, or, oh, you're a crummy spiked club, or that sort of thing, then definitely these are cool little places. I mean, you got a bed for respawning, medicine cabinet with a beaker in it. Of course, they're not always going to have a beaker, but minor details aside. Then, of course, campfire, and granted, the wood isn't the most durable of materials, but it's not horrible. It's, uh, it's manageable. So just for kicks, I said I was going to do something like, I don't remember in the slightest way how to make this stupid thing. Yet I realize I just moved everything around in a way that didn't do anything. Okay. Let's do it. Oh, two pipes, one plank. Okay, well, whatever. Close enough. I said I might make a blunderbuss just for giggles, and here we go. 
It's a green blender bus. That's a shame that it's not any better. And we'll go ahead and do 20 of these guys just to get rid of everything. And, yeah, I know. Blunderbuss is kind of lame. I have a shotgun, so why would I want a blunderbuss? But uh, it's just kind of fun to mess with. Why not? It's basically all made out of free stuff. Oh, are you the end? You are. Well, bummer. That was basically it. A little cabin right there. And a born and noble. So I think I shall continue down the road south. Nothing else, I can kind of start filling in a little bit of that, and I will rejoin you. Something I've been thinking about a fair amount. Between both this series and my Walking Dead series, I haven't really found any wastelands. What's up with that? The only wasteland i found is the hub, and that goes for both series. That kind of bothers me a little bit. I mean... They're a lot of fun. I, I would like more wastelands. What's up with that? I had a bunch of them. Whoa, hello. Dude's way up on the roof. Which makes me think. I never got up on the roof the last time I was in one of those buildings. Hmm, I'll have to try that. But, wastelands are fun. It's where you find all sorts of good stuff. It's exciting. Non-stop zombie action. You know, it's just, it's a good time. And I'm a little disappointed that I haven't really found any. Let's go start clubbing zombies. This will go a little faster, I think. Well, aside from big guy here. Ooh, not particularly good swings there. Go ahead and give this guy a whirl. I did make it after all. Oh, bad lumberjack. And even worse aim. Here, let's go ahead and just club him. I don't want to waste another on him. Go get rid of that guy. Nurse, what do you have? I'll take one of those. Seems like I just used one. Back here, let's just get that all nice and lined up pretty-like. Okay, you guys can just... Oh, what? You're not dead? Why Why didn't you choose to die? Oh, yeah, that was bad. I, I saw the crawly guy and I, I panicked a little bit here. Fine. I'll just... Ow! Two chest shots doesn't take him out, huh? That's interesting. How about that? That was a terrible shot in the shoulder. If I get a good clean shot in the face with this, will it be enough? Well, that's the problem. I didn't get a clean shot in the face. I think that went over his shoulder. Let's try one more time. There we go. I think I need to aim a little higher with this than with other things. Here. Yeah, see, a chest shot on that guy isn't even enough either. That's kind of disappointing. Oh, that was pretty terrible too. You know what? I kind of hate the blunderbuss. I really kind of do. Yep. Here, let's just go ahead and shoot this guy in the face. Except I can't seem to hit him. I think I would rather use the sawed-off shotgun, and I hate that thing. You know what? Here. Gentlemen, sir, have a blunderbuss. Have some ammo. That thing is just garbage. Yeah, I know. I'm not good with it, and I'm sure in the hands of someone who is, it's totally fine and a perfectly valid weapon. Ugh, I think I've said enough on it. Nope, we need this guy. I don't remember. Oh, no. Yeah, no, I didn't need that guy. Oh, hi. Can I ask you to stop doing that? Thank you. Aw, oh, man. I lost some wellness because of that. That's no fun. Here, let's stop the bleeding. And get inside. Are there any safes in here? I don't even remember. How sad is that? I know there's going to be some file cabinets and other things worth checking, but... I don't remember if there were any safes. Hmm. I mean, really, file cabinets... Just kind of looking for ammo, that sort of thing. This is going to be the fastest run through a bookstore ever. Maybe. Possibly. Nope. How about you? Beer, because, you know... My local bookstore always sells beer. Does yours? I'll check one of these just for kicks. Nothing in there. Did I miss a safe back here? Just taking a quick look. Doesn't seem like it. Okay. Open door. Yeah, storeroom isn't particularly exciting in this building. Should be a bathroom right here. Door was unlocked. Now it's really unlocked. That's a really high medicine cabinet. Good luck 
getting in there, most everyone. Painkillers in the trash, because that's where I would leave them too. Well, I'm thinking about it. Thank you, and thank you. Go ahead and take those, why not? Don't remember there aren't being any safes at all, but corpses, always worth checking. Look at that, some more shotgun shells. Good stuff there. Definitely appreciate that. I'll go ahead and say it was worth it just for those eight shells, because I've probably wasted at least that many. Man, that is... I wonder if that building, that ceiling is structurally sound. I'd be curious to see what happens if recalculated. It might just give it up and fall apart. I'm not really sure. Let's go ahead and run back outside here. Say hello to this guy. And let's just check out what's in the shed here. Chances are not too much. Yep. About what I thought. Oh, sure, we can take one water. I know, I probably could have taken that earlier, but... Minor details. Let's see what we have over here. Got a car. Cars are always worth checking out. Let's see what they have. It has, maybe. Yeah, blue pickaxe. That's not going to do me any good. Um, that gun safe is in a rather awkward position there. Now, is this totally cheating just standing here and opening it? I mean, it is kind of sticking out such that I can just grab it, but that doesn't seem quite right. What do we have here? All junk. Oh, I suppose I'll check that garbage. Look at that. Extra pipe. Good, because I do need to make a weapon repair kit and probably need to fix some of my tools up. So let's see where this has me going. I don't know that I want to continue going west, but I would like a wasteland or something along those lines. One of those big townships that has lots of stores. I would, I'd be okay with that. Let's see. Maybe I will go west a little bit more just because I think... I'm going to check the map here. If I go east, uh, I have one biome that I haven't been in. And then... I think, yeah, see, I'm going to end up hitting that forest over there that I've already been in, and then I suppose I can swing around that way, but... Oh, hi. I heard you sneaking up on me. Let's try this again. Without the dying part. Okay. Well, it's a good thing I keep an extra first aid kit around, because I'm going to go ahead and use it. Zap, zap, zap. Yeah, does this guy have anything interesting? Not a thing. Okay, let me go out this way one more time just so I can check where I want to go. Because that right there is going to be south of my current residence. And I suppose I could continue east a little bit, but really I would need to go south more than anything else. So I think I'll take this road out of here south. And you can see I was already kind of running that direction, so it is another snowy forest sort of thing, but that's where I'm going to head. I'm just going to cut straight through here, and I suppose I should be smart about this and put my shotgun back on my belt, just to have it ready in case I need it. But that's where I'm headed. So, I will rejoin you probably in that snowy forest, or potentially in that snowy forest, and if not, then in some other place when I find something that is worth sharing, because thus far, bookstores aren't really doing much for me. Sorry to say. It's day 38. I have everything covered insofar as books. So I'll catch you on the next one. Thanks for watching. See you later.